Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to change your name in Google Classroom. So this is going to work on any mobile device, also it's the same type of thing on PC, etc. So whatever device you have, it's going to be the same type of process throughout. So first of all, you're going to go to like the Google Classroom like homepage here, you'll see it like on the app or whatever. Uh, then you're going to want to click on the top right hand corner, you will see like potentially your profile picture will just be like a, a coloured circle with a letter and you want to click on there. Then it's going to bring up uh, like where say your, your name, your email underneath it, then it will say manage your Google account. You're going to want to click on manage your Google account there. And it's going to bring up this Google account page. Uh, then you're going to want to go on personal info and privacy, click there. It's going to open the settings, uh, bring you to here and then it was going to say at the top there name. Obviously you're going to want to click on that part. Uh, it's going to load up for a few seconds and then it's going to get to your name that you already got there. And then you're going to click on the pencil that says beside your name. And then it's going to bring up like your first name and last name. You can change these in here. So for instance, just click on them, uh, delete that, and then uh, type in like your first name and last name you want to change it to. And you can click between them there. So it's going to go first name and then last name. And then click done. And then just click done on the bottom right hand corner there. It's going to load and then you're going to go, you're going to see it's changed to first name and last name. You can go back in there. You'll see that it's changed from your like your previous one uh, to like your new one right there. So hopefully that did help you out. And remember, this is going to be the same on all Google accounts. This will change it, uh, not just for Google Classroom, but all your Google accounts overall. So leave a like on the video if that did help out. Subscribe for more videos like this. Click on the screen to see more how-to videos and videos similar to like this. That's it for now. I'll see you in the next video.